So I came to this training about five and a half years ago. Um, and I was a mess when I came to the training. Any, every, every strategy, I tried so many things and everything I tried hadn't worked for me. And there was little elements of relief in there, but uh, I'd reached a point where I was fully, fully um, uh, disturbed and upset and frustrated with, with my life because everything I had tried hadn't brought me the well-being that was promised, basically. And I had an empty bank account and a uh, disturbed family as a result of this. Um, and then, yeah, and then I met the Balance View training and uh, whether I wanted to be involved with this uh, training in this context was irrelevant because I saw the benefits immediately. It pr presented me with a, with a completely different and simple mode of relating to the entirety of my experience rather than uh, trying to figure it all out and analysing it. And, applying different techniques to feel okay. Basically, I was just invited to relax for short moments. And that was uh, revolutionary. And that's all I've done since. Um, <laughs> <coughs> and um, the four mainstays bring me a huge amount of relief and a great sense of well-being. And, um, I've had really a good opportunity the last year or so to, to put this into action and see the benefits of it. Um, four mainstays for me are essential. Three mainstays doesn't quite cut it. Four mainstays is, is, is a necessary uh, algorithm. And um, I love what Asaf shared about feeling depressed and then just seeing somebody and a smile and it's, in that moment, it's gone. I can't hold on to the, uh, the affliction anymore. I try really hard, but it doesn't work. As Saf said the other day, he wanted to tickle me when he sees me like that. <coughs> You're all invited. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's really the community for me is uh, a beautiful thing. Um, I have such, before I met the training, I, I, you know, I had many friends, but I never really allowed myself to, to experience uh, the capacity to, to be in deep friendship and relationship with people, and I have this with, I have this with everybody now, it's amazing. Um, uh, what else? Training? Oh, the training, yeah. The training is uh, phenomenal. I couldn't really... I mean, I could probably try and describe to you how it works and does what it does, but there's something that happens in the context of the training setting that is, it's amazing. Four weeks ago, I thought I was going a bit crazy. Just a bit, everything was a bit crazy. And then a few weeks in training, and it's just like, the moment I step into the training environment, it's like a full reset, a full reset. And then to spend a few weeks in this environment is... Uh, everything opens up completely. So the, this craziness I was experiencing was actually a great thing because with the context of the four mainstays, it just becomes real potency. Um, so that's the training. And what else is there? Um, training, community, trainer. Yeah. yeah, I have a great relationship with my trainer. He's uh, uh, fully supportive. I've sent him many strange and wonderful emails and... <laughs> At one point, I had to really clarify with him if he would still be my trainer, because I thought that I had stepped out of the zone of being supported. And uh, he said, of course, there's nothing I could do that would, that would break that relationship. Um, and short moments. I always leave short moments to last, because I still don't know. I still have very little understanding of what a short moment is. Um, short moments happen for me. They're just something which occurs. Um, but they don't occur through my attempt to make them happen. Um, my sen yeah, it's like simply by showing up in the context of the four mainstays, short moments happen. That's my experience, rather than me thinking, oh, I really need to take a short moment now. Um, that's a short moment for me, actually, just that, that recognition. So.